Hey y'all! Pageantry has advanced to a whole new level and here in Taraba State today we have amazing kings and queens in the industry. Welcome to Aboki Music TV. We are going to be having a quick chat with Miss Taraba, Her Royal Majesty, Queen Justina Haruna. I am Eddie Jung Juna. Stay with us. What's up, baby? What's up? What's up? What's up? What's up? Baby, what's up? What's up? What's up? What's up? Baby, what's up? What's up? What's up? What's up? Baby, what's up? Sitting out of all with the new sex. My name is Justina Haruna. I'm from the local government. I'm a student and I base in Jalingo. I sketch and I'm a makeup artist. I just love art. I've been a lover of modeling and that's my hobby all this while. And I've been obsessed with pageantry for two years now. Beauty Tukura has been my role model since when she has been Miss Nigeria. And the likes of Queen Shah Tugar Food, the 44th Miss Nigeria, Queen Sarah Bolos, Miss Glamour and a lot of them. I just love pageantry. Prime Planet event managers are the official organizers of Mr. and Mr. Raba. And I was targeting the state crown. That is why I contested under their own platform. Firstly, I'm a victim of low self-esteem and have been fighting it for a very long time. And when I went to camp, I was the least contestant and have the least special future for this contest. For me to overcome it, I had to go on catwalk sessions and watch videos, YouTube videos from national to state contests. It was really challenging and stressful, but God did. The search and crown symbolizes the girl child and also power and the responsibility of me as a queen to protect the girl child. Pageantry in the past years have not been something to write home about, but of the recent pageantry has been acceptable from our heads and communities and our parents. And many people are buying the ideas. Many platforms have been registered, and many queens and kings are coming strong from all local governments. I tagged my big project, which is reaching the regions of Taraba State, because I lived around Mukai, where I see a lot of women with kids and they are all dressed and fashioned. I went to the community and I realized they don't have good clothing and they don't have good food. So I decided to tag my pet project, reaching the videos. And I think I have impacted a lot when I went there. After my win as Mr. Rava 2022-2023, I will take it slow because I'm a student. After two years, I will go for the national crown. To that black girl at home who thinks she can do it, and to that black girl who has finance problems, I think dreaming big is not is not a kind, and you can make it just like I did. All you need to do is keep pushing and keep grinding and the sky is the starting point. Now that is today's episode of Celebrity Spotlight. Please don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel. Stay with us. See you next time. Ciao!